here to present the first ever early career award, Rob Kubik. Thank you, Melissa. Like you, I always enjoy doing public speaking following Dr. Barkley. <laughs> Good afternoon. On behalf of the awards committee, it's my distinct pleasure to make this first ever presentation of the OSPA Early Career Award. The purpose of the award is to recognize the accomplishments of a school psychologist during the first five years of his or her career. Nominees should demonstrate a commitment to the practice and promotion of school psychology, research, and advocacy membership in local, state, and national organizations, presentation of research at professional conferences, and participation in volunteer and advocacy efforts are considered. Today, I'm honored to present this award to a dear colleague of mine in the Akron Public Schools, Mrs. Kelly Kreitz. Kelly, come on forward. Kelly completed her graduate work at Kent State University and interned in the Akron Public Schools during the 2008 to 2009 school year. She's been working there full time ever since. Though it's only been four years, to many colleagues of hers who have become her friends, it seems more like 14 years that she's always been one of us. To those individuals who fail to look out to, for the best interests of her students, though, it probably seems like she's been in Akron for 40 years. She's been an active OSPA member from her earliest student days. She's been a member of the executive board for the past two years as a special presidential appointee. She was tasked with serving as the co-chair of OSPA's Early Career Task Force Initiative. In this capacity, she has been our outreach liaison from the executive board to the student and intern members. Under her leadership, this task force has developed a strong mentorship program that matches newcomers in the field with veteran field-based practitioners. It has long been a goal of OSPA's executive board to have a thoughtful and tangible effort to develop the leadership capacities of our next generation of Ohio school psychologists by taking deliberate initiatives to integrate these early career professionals into the workings of our association, and it is largely due to Kelly that this vision is finally being realized. In addition to her ongoing and active OSPA membership, she's also a longtime member of NASP, has previously presented at their convention, and the Kent Akron Association of School Psychologists. While attending Kent State, Kelly served as the chair of her local student affiliates of school psychology and as a NASP student leader. She's also participated in the Kent State University Transition Collaborative. Since coming to the Akron Public School, she began taking a leadership role in our department right from the start. Despite becoming a newcomer into a group of accomplished school psychologists, some with well-developed egos, Kelly quickly asserted herself and provided much needed and critical direction during an important time of transition in the leadership of our department. One example, she serves as the chair of the professional learning community for the school psychologists in the Akron Public Schools. One initiative that she did in that context involved coordinating efforts so that her two dozen colleagues would participate in RTI initiatives and meetings in other colleagues' buildings. By doing so, each school psychologist was able to observe their colleagues engaging in intervention, team-based practice, generating new ideas, and examining their own professional practices. Kelly also has longstanding membership on the Faculty Advisory Committee, and in this capacity, she's recently provided oversight and direction to our entire process of allocating human resources in our, our department to best meet the needs of students in the school district at large. She's also extended her professional development efforts to improve technical skills and competencies of professionals across our school district. One example is her active participation and leadership in the autism professional learning community for the Akron Public Schools and the subsequent training team that helps develop the professional skills of our colleagues. She's presented at the local, state, and national level on topics such as assessments with students with autism and effective transition planning for secondary students with disabilities. Her prior scholarly and research activities merited her being recognized with the Educational Testing Service Recognition of Excellence, as well as the Kent State University College of Education Award for Outstanding Service and Leadership. Kelly is highly efficient, yet thorough. She's a practitioner that goes out of her way to share her time and her strategies with her colleagues. She routinely evaluates more students in a given year than nearly anyone in our department, yet her assessments and reports are highly lauded in terms of their depth, attention to detail, and robust assessment to intervention recommendations. She willingly supervised a doctoral level intern this year, the very first year in which she was eligible to do so. She regularly volunteers for a variety of departmental, district, and community-based initiatives. 
Finally, no statement on Kelly's behalf would be complete without recognizing her outstanding personal qualities. She has a wonderful sense of humor, is supportive beyond measure to all who seek her assistance, and has earned the complete confidence and trust of her coworkers, students, and families. Despite a career that is just in its beginning stages, she's already earned the highest level of respect and admiration from all of us that know her well. So you can tell we like her quite a bit. It is for these reasons and many more that the Ospel Awards Committee on behalf of the Executive Board hereby recognizes Mrs. Kelly Kreitz to be our first ever recipient of the Ohio School Psychologist Association Early Career Award. Kelly. Okay, I've been coerced into giving a few words. Um, so I'll give my quick little Grammy acceptance speech, if you don't mind. Um, there are a couple of people I wanted to thank. First, I just want to say thank you to the OSPA Executive Board and the Awards Committee, um, really for just recognizing us lowly newbies out there in the field. Um, thank you to Rob Kubik for nominating me for this award um, and making me sound way more amazing than I actually am. So if you ever lack some confidence, just go hang out with Rob for a day. Um, I wanted to thank Dr. Perry Clark. He's not here today, but he is the supervisor of school psychologists in Akron. Um, and I think anyone would agree with me that he is the most amazing boss to ever work for. Um, it's just a great feeling to go to work every day with this massive amount of support behind you and to be advocated for and promoted um, within our, our district and state. Um, and he's been a really good influence on me and I just want to make him proud. Um, I wanted to thank Susan Kruger. She is my date here today <laughs> for the awards. Um, Susan was my supervisor my internship year. Um, and since that time, she has become my second mom and my mentor and my best friend in this field. Um, never underestimate the power of a supervisor. Um, everything good that I do is because I learned it from her. So thank you, Susan. Um, and lastly, I just want to say thank you to all my colleagues in Akron Public Schools. Um, for those of you that don't know me, I might be a little bit of a competitive person, um, and there is so much to compete against in Akron, it's insane. So they push me every single day to be better at what I do. So thank you very, very much for this award.